The dream that people have is to retire early, like I did when I was 37. And I thought my life would only get better and it actually got worse. In some situations. First of all, to be able to retire early, you can't have any kids. And if you don't have any kids, a lot of the uh, girls out there want kids. So I had to look for a girl that doesn't want kids. And I found my ex-wife. Why is there an ex? Because the problem is that when you do this kind of stuff, you start to have different goals in life. The problem is that uh, your wife is full of payments, or my wife was full of payments and buying stuff and five years together, she got nowhere. She's making as much money as she's spending. She's not even paying back her, her debt. And uh, her debt keep accumulating. And all of a sudden she has too much. And at that point you start to freak out. And then you're afraid that uh, you're gonna start losing the money. And then it gets into your head. You realize that everything you worked for your life in your life, the fact that you stopped at 39, you don't have the skills to, to, to fit into a workplace anymore. I'm, I'm 42 now and for the past five years I've been working here and there, but I can't really stand having a boss anymore. So that messes up with your head and you realize that you could lose all that. And that's scary. Because if you lose all that, it's just the worst, scariest uh, thought in the world. The bank comes over and takes everything away from you. So I had a chat with my wife and I told her, I said, hey, I can't live like this. We gotta do something about it. And she didn't wanna work with me. Five years, she keep pushing the down date and saying that, oh yeah, I'm gonna fix it next year. Oh, I'm making this plan. I'm making this spreadsheet. I'm gonna fix it, fix it, fix it. And with a very, very good salary, she just couldn't fix it. So all of a sudden, you know, panic kicked in and I decided that I'm gonna give her an ultimatum and it was a bluff and she didn't call it. So we're divorced. I filed the paperwork for the divorce and we are separated. And now we're still very good friends. Uh, she still lives in my, in my house and we don't really have a future. Uh, we have whatever we have. She watches my dog in my house while I'm here and then when I go back over there I I have a house that still has a fence and you know little things like those but it's just the nature of the beast uh, I can't uh, this is the, the downside of, of being retired early is that you, you gotta you gotta stick to the plan you gotta have that math figured out and if somebody comes in your life and doesn't follow the math then it screws up everything that you have. And then it doesn't work out. So, can I get another wife? <laughs> the problem is that uh, when you reach a certain age, you just cannot have a precise plan anymore if you want to meet somebody because this precise plan only works if you uh, stick to it. But if you don't stick to it, it just doesn't work out. You have no plan. What you have is you have a, a person that's gonna come into your life and is gonna have maybe kids, maybe babies, gonna have bills, gonna have headaches, gonna have problems, is gonna have uh, uh, issues, is gonna have debt maybe. And finding somebody that is like you, that doesn't have any debt, uh, doesn't have any problems in life, it's, those are, you know, the unicorn. So whoever's left out there is just gonna be set in either in their own ways if they have the money and if they don't have the money they're gonna gonna be it's gonna be very hard to make the sacrifices because whatever you compl uh, get complacent and then uh, you start helping them out and trying to make a plan they're gonna ruin it for you and then the thoughts of, of losing everything will come back and that's gonna be the end so retired when you're 37 when you're 40 works but it almost works being alone or if you're lucky enough to have a high school sweetheart that you don't get pregnant and you both work for the same goal and then when you get into your 40s you both achieve the double than you could achieve by yourself but for me it took me two divorces and uh, all those extra headaches to get where I am right now 
and I'm not gonna make the third the third the third the third time the mistake. So, ladies, you know those ladies are watching the video right now, which is like one. Sorry, but that's the truth. I just cannot make the compromise anymore. That ship has sailed. I'm in a different part of life and I enjoy it. I like not worrying about the day of tomorrow. I like not worrying about what's gonna happen when I'm older. I like all these things, but uh, going through two marriages that didn't work out because of the fact that nobody wanted to stick with the plan, I realized that those are the types of people that will never have anything and it's just an incompatible lifestyle with mine. So here we are, uh, planning to live my life with a Ferrari, yeah, I want to own a Ferrari in my life, that's, that's my goal. Um, you know, play my life with, with all this stuff. It is the curse of being retired early and you should keep in mind that this is just part of life. There is no really a way around it. If you do the math, it's never gonna work out with nobody. You can only do this by yourself. Except if you find a unicorn. That lady that, that wants to work with you. Because if they don't, then your fate is sealed from the beginning. And every time we start a relationship, we started on looks and the way that it feels, the way that uh, you like the person instead of, you know, you can't ask him on a first date, hey, how are you doing financially? So, yeah, it's, uh, it is nice, and I choose this over anything else. You know what they say, nice states, and in the world, you should never own things that uh, fly, float, or F-U-C-K. You should always rent. And I've reached uh, my 42 years old age to realize that. I'm never gonna buy a boat. I'm gonna rent, I'm never gonna buy a plane, I'm gonna rent. And then of course I'm gonna rent the last one. Because it's just cheaper. And you could keep up your life, keep your plans and be happy. It's as simple as that. I figured out the code for you guys. Thanks for watching. I appreciate the views. I have other videos on my channels, uh, vlogging from my bicycle. I hope you enjoy them. Let me know what you think at the bottom of the video. And if I'm right or wrong, vote with your thumbs up or thumbs down. Biggest Romaniac, out. <laughs>